Hello, this is Mazen Kerala, and today for the five minute critical care concept, we're going to be talking about pressure regulated volume controlled mode of ventilation. In traditional volume controlled mode of ventilation, like SIMV, if the resistance is increased, the machine will use a higher pressure to achieve the same target tidal volume. This pressure change is occurred right after the resistance is increased. Now, in pressure regulated volume controlled mode of ventilation, and you can turn that on on Draeger by going to the add settings, auto flow, and turn it on. Notice that when you turn the auto flow on, the flow wave form is changed from a square wave to a decelerating wave indicating that this is pressure delivered breath or pressure regulated breath in pressure regulated volume control or auto flow on Draeger if the resistance is increased the next breath will be delivered with the same pressure and results into much lower tidal volume at that point the pressure will go up gradually by two to three centimeter each breath you can see the gradual increase in the pressure and the gradual increase in the tidal volume till it gets to the target tidal volume of 500 at that point the pressure will be maintained at this new level when the resistance is decreased the next breath will be given with the same tidal volume and results into with the same pressure i'm sorry and result into much larger tidal volume at that point the pressure will start going will start going down gradually till you get to the same tidal volume level that is targeted by the machine so the pressure goes down again two to three centimeter each breath till you get to the minimum pressure required to deliver that target tidal volume now notice that we have the alarm limit here at 50. let's change that to an alarm limit of 40 and do the same procedure again at this point we're going to decrease the compliance remarkably and the decrease in compliance will result into much lower tidal volume the same pressure is used as the previous breath then the pressure starts to go up two to three centimeter each breath and the volume is building up here 119 so we need a higher pressure two to three centimeter up and then <clears throat> the tidal volume is 140 higher pressure higher tidal volume we need to reach the 500 target now the pressure is building up gradually and it's achieving now a level of 30 but the tidal volume is 239 we need a higher pressure tidal volume of 269 the pressure goes up to 32 tidal volume, tidal volume of 300 the pressure stays at 35 and doesn't go up any higher than this now when uh, the compliance is improved the next breath will be given with the same pressure and results into a higher tidal volume of 795 then the pressure will start going down gradually two to three centimeters of water each breath till we get to the target tidal volume of 500 so in summary pressure regulated volume controlled mode of ventilation or auto flow on Draeger is a mode that try to achieve the target tidal volume with a minimum pressure the change in the pressure is occurred gradually up or gradually down down to achieve that target volume i hope you benefited from this five minute critical care concept and hope to see you in the next future sessions. Thank you.